pitch way outside as Friend steals third. He's now on third. 1-1 one, one on Dennis Grossell. The pitch swung on and missed. Nice curveball there. And Conklin ahead of the count one and two on Grossell. Grossell batting 372 as Conklin works quickly. The pitch curveball outside ball two. Much to the dislike of Anthony Wayne's fan base here at Bowling Green State. Friend over on third, the 2-2 two, two tip, two, two pitch, high and away, ball three. Three and two now on the starting quarterback for the football team. The payout pitch, swung on, roped up into right field. Friend will come home to score. Your Wildcats take a one nothing lead. Sweet and simple is Dennis Grossell. And just like that, the Wildcats on the board here in the first inning. One nothing. Two hits on the day already here in the first inning off of Michael Conklin. And that will bring up the DH in George Asadorian. That pitch swung on and missed for strike one. For Dennis Grossell, that's his 23rd run batted in on the year. Magic number 23 there. Oh, one pitch swung on, hit to left field. Going over there is the left hitter Mowry. It will drop for a base hit all the way to the warning track. Coming around third, scoring is Dennis Grossell with no throw. RBI double for George Asadorian. Your Wildcats, just like yesterday, on top 2 nothing now. Scoring from first was Dennis Grossell in the Wildcats getting on. Michael Conklin here early. And that will now bring up Kevin Mingus. Unbelievable first inning here for the Wildcats as probably not what Mark Nell wanted to do but here in the first inning, but he'll have to go out to talk to his pitcher in infield as it's not a good start here today for the Generals. Whereas the Wildcats... Sticking to their game plan, just like yesterday. Scoring in the first inning is always crucial for these guys, and they're doing it with the big hits here today. Three hits already in the first inning. As it will now be Kevin Mingus with the runner on second one out the pitch. Curveball in there, strike one. That pitch swung out, popped up, shallow right. There is the second baseman, Narker. He'll make the catch for out number two. That will now bring up Ryan Jacobs. Two outs, and that is a nice curveball in there from... Conklin for strike one. He has that curveball going for him today. Wildcats just have to sit back on that one and hit it as Jacobs does so, hitting it to left. But there is the left fielder, Mowry, for out number three. But the Wildcats get on board here first. Two runs on three hits and lead Anthony Brown. Anthony Brown. Anthony Wayne. After the top of the first, we'll take a break here on the SIBN. It's 2 0 Wildcats. Not give it. 